Jacquees got jammed up for reckless driving, littering, and possessions of drugs. Here's the article as I read. The one and only exclusive. Listen, we're going to get all the information here from Desert Sun. Singer Jacquees arrested for driving 116 miles per hour. Marijuana possession in Atlanta, Georgia. And reads. Atlanta police arrest singer and songwriter Josh Queese on a drug charge during a traffic stop early Thursday morning. APD said Rodriguez Broadnax, who gave by his name, by his stage name, Jacquees, was driving a 2007 Bentley Continental. When the incident took place, Stanisha Bowell was a passenger in the car. Around 3 a.m., an officer said he used a speed detection device and spotted Jacquees traveling 116 miles per hour on I-85 North. Police pulled him over and said they noticed something, someone throwing something out of the passenger window. The vehicle pulled to the shoulder but continued rolling a short distance. While it was rolling, the officer observed item being thrown out of the passenger window. Once the vehicle stopped, the officer approached the driver who advised him that he had thrown marijuana from the vehicle, Atlanta police said. Police say they found more pot in Barwell's possession during a search of the Bentley and recover about three grams of marijuana. Authorities charged Jacquees with speeding, reckless driving, littering, and possession of a controlled substance. Barwell is charged with possession of a controlled substance. This is the singer's third run-in with police in just a couple of months. According to WTMJ in Milwaukee, authorities detained site Jacquees with disorderly conduct at Milwaukee General Min Mitchell's International Airport earlier this month. NBC Miami also reported a March arrest. Police arrest Jacquees on Miami Beach for failure to obey an officer and disorderly conduct. The singer Jacquees is known for his hits such as Bed, and at the club in hells from Decatur, George. Now, guys, this explains why all these rappers, and we're going to name the three right off the bat, man. Boosie, Quando Rondo, and Jacquees. Funny how they all been charged with either fucking guns and drug possessions or acting a goddamn fool with drugs or gun possessions. In this case, Jacquees acting a damn fool with drugs in his possession. As I read, he already had run-ins three times in a span of three months. The Negro driving over the speed limit 116 on I-85 North in Atlanta. So obviously that lets y'all know the nigga wasn't sober. He was high. Probably on other shit too. But either way it goes. Jacquees, let me talk to you. This my first time hearing you getting arrested on stupid ass shit like this. I already know you smoke tons of weed. Of course, all you rappers doing drugs, that's a given. But my God, now your face is in the police uh, yearbooks, whatever the fucking book you want to call it. All you ninjas are in the police world now. Of course, you're going to bail out. You know, it is what it is on that. But the whole gist of it is... Now you got a trap record. Now they got a paper trail. And it don't look good that you don't like to obey officers. And it don't look good that you got jammed up with drugs. Come on, man. You're damn near 30. Like, you switch your style up, cutting your hair short. I don't know what the fuck that was about. You should just cut it all off. But, you know, that's just my opinion. 
You captain said you'll never cut your hair. That's why you don't believe these motherfucking people. They people. They humans. We all say dumb things. We always say things. And then we go back on them. But that's either here or there. The whole point is. Come on, guys. You driving 116. You know you already high as hell. Drunk as hell if you was drinking. But fact is known you was high as fuck. You gave the reason the police pull you over, and now they got another one. You know? It seems like the niggas with money are the dummies. They need to give niggas, the real ones like me, they money, and I'll show you what to do with it. Because these dumbass niggas don't know what to do with their money, but just blow it on stupid ass shit. You know? Now he gone viral. And all a bunch of other YouTubers are, you know, making videos, you know. But, hey, ain't much on it right now. You know, I don't know if he bunded out yet, but either way it go, hit that like, share, subscribe, and turn that notification bell on. Keep the most high y'all first always. Your boy, Fab Studios. Y'all have a blessed Sunday. I'm out.